good morning friends so 9th standard class 9th standard so exercise 8.1 so the triangular side wall of a flyover have been used for advertisements the side of the walls are 122 meter 22 meter and 120 meter so these are the sides of the walls so the advertisement yield an earning of rupees 5000 per meter square per area a company hired one of its wall for 3 months one of the company hired for this one, one this one for 3 months how much rent did it pay so he is asked he is asked that rent paid by that company so for the 3 months so triangular side walls of flyover this is the flyover diagram he has given so in this diagram this is a 120 this is the triangular so this 120 and this 22 meter and 120 122 meter is the, these are the sides of the triangle and also here is one more triangle so in this uh, they are putting on advertisement uh, the advertisement yield an earning of rupees 5000 so per per square meter it is earning 5000 so now we have to find out what is the total area of this triangle so now after finding this total area now we can find out per square meter if it is 5000 means what will happen for this total area so here first we have to use that uh, heron's formula to find out uh, the total area of this triangle because he has given all sides so using the sides uh, we can find out the uh, area of the triangle uh, with the help of heron's formula so now we use that one so it is a heron formula so heron formula is uh, so the triangle given is like this so this is what 22 centimeter and this is 120 and this is 122 so in this uh, we know that heron's formula heron's formula of area of triangle is equal to square root of s s minus a e, s minus b and s minus c this is the triangle formula now here s is the semi perimeter s is equal to what semi perimeter that is a plus b plus 0 by 2 so here is a b c so what are the values 120 plus 120 plus 22 plus 122 divided by 2 so here that will become s will become so 264 by adding these three uh, 22 122 and 2 to 4 4 is there 2 plus 2 6 6 plus 2 2 3 6 and 1 1 plus 2 so 2 1s are 2 3s are 2 2s are so 132 is the semi perimeter of this triangle now you put this in the formula so that formula what s is 132 this is the s value and one more s is what 132 we know s a is what suppose if i took this one is a a and uh, well, again 132 s so this s and minus b is 22 and 132 and minus c is 122 so now use this 132 simplify this one uh, 132 minus uh, uh, this is what 120 so 132 minus 120 means 12 so and 132 minus 22 means 2 2 0 uh, 3 2 1 so this will become 110 so and again uh, this is 12 and this 110 and this will become uh, 2 3 2 1 and this is 0 so this will become like this after subtracting this and again we have to simplify this one so in the simplification uh, so the overall by multiplying this one with the 10 this will become 13 20 and uh, multiplying these two 12 0 12 ones are 12 so carry one 12 ones are 12 13 so 13 20 multiply this one and then this one and this one so now we will get a square root of 13 20 square so now using this one uh, you can take it outside because this square and this root get cancelled so square centimeter so now the what is the area is given sorry in terms of meter is given so 
this will become square meter area of the triangle but uh, for one square meter so is the one square meter is told that rupees 5000 for one square meter how, few, how much he told that one rupees 15000 yes told now we have 13 20 square meter triangle this is the triangle so in this uh, per square meter per square meter is 5000 so for total this is what 13 20 square meter so now for 13 square square question mark so in this question mark is equal to 13 20 into 5000 divided by 1 so now we will get uh, how much amount for multiplying these two we get uh, around uh, I will write like this four zeros uh, and uh, the meaning is 13 of uh, 132 plus 5 2 is 10 and 31 5 3 is 15 16 carry 1 5 1 is 5 5 1 is 5 6 5 3 is 15 plus 1 16 6 60,000 for this is one year so one year is equal to rupees six lakh sixty thousand so six lakh sixty thousand rupees here for one year so he is asked for the three months in the question he is asking you for the three months he has to pay rent for the three months so in the this is for three months he is asked so 12 months, how much rupees? 12 months rupees 6 lakh 60,000 rupees. So, for 3 months, question mark. So, here the answer is 3 into 6 lakh 60,000 divided by 12. 3 ones are, 3 fours are, 4 ones are, 4 ones are, 2 remaining, 4, uh, four ones are 4 and 2 remaining, 26, 4 six are 24. And it will become 1 to 2 and remaining. So, 1 lakh 65,000 rupees he has to pay for the 3 months. So, for 3 months, how much he has to pay? 1 lakh 65,000 rupees. So, this is what the answer for the problem. So, now you take it down. Thank you.